Hello friends, in this video I will explain how you can stage the changes for your git repository in VS Code. So what happens is that let us say you have changed say 5 files but most of the times what we want to do is we want to commit just say 2 files out of 5. So that is when the staging comes into picture. So with the staging what you can do is that let us say you can just stage 2 files and then commit those 2 files only and then push it to the remote repository and then other three files that have been changed that can be committed and pushed later on so that is possible with the help of staging so let us see how you can do this staging in VS Code so to see like what files have changed in VS Code you have to click on this button source control and there you will see all the list of files that have changed and out of that let us say you want to stage this this particular file so if you take a mouse on that file you will notice that there is a plus button just click on that and then that particular file will be staged and you can see only this file has been sta uh, staged and other files are down here and what happens is that now if you commit let me put the commit message here this code and then if I press the commit what happens is that only this VS code tips.md this file will be committed to the repository and then if you do push only that change will be pushed to the remote repository other changes these files these four files those changes will still be in your local directory and and uh, it will not be a part of the repository as well so it will be a different change set okay so now I'm gonna commit this and you will notice that the staged changes this thing will wipe away and now it is a part of the repository so if you look at the history of the repo it will be displayed in that history and if you do push the, those changes will be pushed to the remote repository as well that's it thanks for watching